Hi there, I'm Katrina with REI Engineering, and today I called Josh Prentice, REI's Land Survey Department Manager, to discuss some of my top questions regarding surveying. So thank you for taking my call, Josh. Let's just jump right in. It sounds so great. What, what are the most common types of surveys? Uh, common types of surveys, uh, there's about four of them that come to my mind right away. Uh, we have boundary surveys, which are typically for residential properties. Uh, relocating their lot corners, finding out where the property is. Uh, we have certified survey maps, which are small land divisions, uh, typically one to four lots on them. Uh, say you want to buy some property from your neighbor or sell some of your property, so we'll utilize that instrument. Uh, FEMA letter of map amendments or elevation certificates. Uh, we will prepare those uh, for people along floodplains to determine if their structures are, or their property are in or out of the floodplain. And the American Land Title Association, also known as ALTAs, uh, typically are for the non-residential properties, uh, commercial buildings. Okay. Um, who needs surveys and why do you need surveys? Uh, there's a lot of people that need surveys. Uh, the most common reason why someone would need a survey is if they're planning on making uh, some type of improvement to their property, such as fencing, landscaping, maybe the addition of a shed or building, you know, general property improvements. Uh, some other uh, reasons why you would get a survey would be uh, maybe you're going to sell your property. Uh, it's going to be part of a, a land transaction or maybe it's part of the contingency of sale. Um, another one would be refinancing. Uh, interest rates are pretty low right now, so uh, people will refinance and oftentimes uh, banks will require a survey to be done. Okay, so right now with uh, a lot of people at home, a lot of home improvement projects and then the combination of really low interest rates, there's Quite a few reasons to need surveys. Oh, absolutely. How do I know what type of survey I would need? Well, typically um, I'll speak with a client and uh, figure out what their needs and desires are. Uh, after I understand what they're looking for, then I can explain to them what type of survey they need and, and kind of what the process is to eat, reach their end goal. Okay. All right. Um, so I have more questions, but we'll continue this conversation down the road a little bit. Um, thank you so much. We'll see you again next time. Thank you.